How's it going everyone? Happy Easter to those of you who celebrate it. Hope you are having a great day. And if you are, drop a like. You know, a while back I created a video of a level 5 elk and after harvesting I truly believed it was bugged. And now after harvesting yet another level 5 elk in the Trailblazer beta, I can confirm that it definitely was indeed bugged, but thankfully it looks like EW has it fixed. Let's check out this hunt as I get into bow range of this level 5 elk and get some great photos before taking him down. You know I was just over at this map, you can see all the tracks I've been doing, but we're over on my favorite part of the map here for hunting elk anyway, and I found this 970 to 1102 elk track here. 970 to 1102 level four It's a great looking level four though um, but unfortunately for him or maybe fortunately better <laughs> there is a level five just right over here who doesn't look that much bigger his antlers are a, a lot longer I should say than uh, than this guy but this guy is a good looking four in comparison to this five let's see if we can get in a little bit closer maybe get some photos and then perhaps get a shot in on this guy I should say the most unfortunate thing that I'm um, you know realizing right now before I try to get in too close to get some photos is that our wind is going directly towards this guy so unfortunately I don't think we're gonna be able to get in close enough for photos and if we try to uh, we might just mess everything up but you know what I've already sprayed myself once I'll spray myself again and uh, you know we'll just uh, see what happens I suppose this reminds me of something I would do to get a turkey as a kid see one we always um, hunted all these uh, creeks going through forests and whatnot and so you'd like see a turkey out in a field or something or on the edge of a field and so you'd like go along the creek bed and like try to sneak in be real stealthy who knows if it'll work out for us though we're gonna get up to this tree right here and we'll see if we can uh, look out and spot him and then we'll be able to make a plan from there I can see our uh, big level four right there but I don't see our level five I think he must be literally on the other side of this tree he is still drinking boy we're, we're getting in bow range honestly I just don't have a bow I have my regular equipment to hunt an Easter egg if I found it. We are completely hidden. Our scent is in the complete opposite direction. We're just kind of, we're gonna tiger stalk this. All these elk are hanging out with the ducks right now. Oh, there's another elk behind him. I can see a deer in the background too. Just hiding in those woods right over there. straight through there here he's moving turn broadside bro oh he's turned is he gonna stop don't you stop Well, it certainly seemed like we'll uh, be doing all right. Of course, it's a little concerning that we don't see any blood on the ground. I know I have the tracks off, but that shouldn't matter when it comes to blood. I'm, not, I'm honestly not sure. It kind of looks like him, doesn't it? I'm, um... I'm like at a loss. I honestly have no idea. I guess we'll get the tracks back off because there was no blood whatsoever. All right. Well, let's take a look at him, I suppose. This is the level five and it is a gold. 326. Wow. Still a lot shy for a diamond. I see. I mean, this is somewhat similar to the last diamond that we shot. It was something similar to this. I mean, a great looking bull. And, uh, you know, low 300s on its way to 380. <sighs> that's a, that's a hike. 
Now you may be just as disappointed as I was that this level 5 elk didn't turn out to be a diamond, and I definitely already reported the no elk blood bug to bug report. But the good thing is that there definitely seems to be some changes made. If we go back and compare to our previous bug level 5 elk, you can see that this other guy was noticeably bigger and yet scored less than this trailblazer beta elk we're looking at now. Now what I want to show you is that there was a large change made to elk in scoring 2.0. Looking at this before and after of a diamond wildebeest from pre and post 2.0, we can see that the trophy rating has stayed somewhat similar, 38.8 and 38.9, even after the scoring changes. Now, comparing this to the elk again, let's check out my massive 994 elk versus the ones today. Yeah, check out that difference. Now you may be thinking this is tied to true racks, but the 994 elk was of course shot after the elk received its true racks, so that shouldn't make a difference. Instead, what I think we're looking at is a change of range for more rack variation. If you take a look at EW's scoring chart, you can see that antlered animals have noticeably huge gaps between silver, gold, and diamond scores, where others only differ by a few dozen points. While this probably isn't news to anyone, it is interesting to see in the flesh, and while it has improved over time as a Kansas native, I am hoping to see even more variety added to the white-tailed deer, as it would be really cool to see a high-scoring gold 8 point, even a 12 or 14 point making a diamond, versus the constant 16 points we're all probably very familiar with. Anywho, it was great to see another level 5 L, cause they are one of my favorite animals to hunt in the game, but the possibility still remains that instead of an increase to antler range, we are experiencing a max score of 380 or 1000 equivalent for a diamond elk right now, instead of the 950 equivalent. Tell me down below what you think about my findings, are you excited to get back out there and hunt more elk after the update, do you think they're fixed, or are there still repairs that need to be made? I'm excited to once again get a diamond elk but i'm still out here looking for this easter egg hope you all are having luck with that but that's going to wrap up this video thank you all for watching youtube mondays twitch wednesdays on the bz hub channel 7 30 to 9 30 p.m central hope to see you there like and subscribe everyone i hope you have a great rest of the day and as always keep gaming never stop